Now, as the world opens up after COVID-19 lockdowns, people are looking for new ways to emerge from that isolation. Rome's urban vegetable gardens are one area that's witnessing renewed interest. The pandemic isolated all of us from our loved ones. Habits and hobbies which took up most of our day were tossed aside. We discovered new habits, new hobbies and a new routine. Meanwhile, in Rome, citizens are now showing an interest towards greener public areas. After two years of isolation, Romans want to be a part of a new initiative, Urban Vegetable Gardens. In the first lockdown, when all outdoor activity was banned, it was these gardens which welcomed citizens and allowed isolated Romans to interact while following social distancing guidelines. During the pandemic, something very interesting happened because everything was closed, including public parks. But since the urban vegetable gardens are something meant to be cultivated, because it's city farming, in reality they stayed open. Lots of people discovered these places because they were the only ones where one could walk in and it was allowed to go because they were open and visible. An increasing number of Romans has turned to vegetable gardens in the last two years. More requests to join are now pouring in. But there are rules to be followed. In order to be transformed into an urban vegetable garden, an area must be a property of the city of Rome and be placed near a source of water. The municipality needs to give consent for the same. But it seems that Romans have been enjoying the manual labor for years. In 2014, thanks to a friend, I received an email about this initiative. And together with a friend, we arrived here and we started this journey together to do some manual labor and share with other people a journey together and share ideas. At the beginning, it was only practical advice on the cultivation of the vegetable garden. Plots inside a vegetable garden provide enough for neighboring families, but more significantly, they have now become a meeting point for the elderly and for those suffering from pandemic loneliness to reconnect in an open green space. Bureau Report, Weon, World is One.